Okay, we're here at Norvig Hospital on day two of the class, and we're doing the small group thing. Now, what happens is this. I always want to have a classroom set up and be able to have five surfaces on which people take turns being the victim. And we made it work here. These are actually tables with sheets on them. But we have five teams. The person wearing the topi is sort of running the scenario. And the person laying down is the victim. And then the team has to respond. And so that's what they're doing. But we have one. Let me turn this way. There's Sharuk. Now we're going to turn this way. We have two. This shows you what we do when we're doing CPR. I don't bring CPR mannequins, but I do have the child's ball that we use when we need to do it. And that's what they're doing. And here's the third group. They're doing airway and compressions, and the guy on the left is doing uh, meds. And they have to respond to whatever the rhythm is held up on the car. So they're working out how the scenarios and what they would do. So then we have this group. And again, the per in this case, the person with the white lab coat in the topi is the assistant. And they're doing CPR and trying to figure out what they're doing. They have an imaginary defibrillator and they just defibrillate it. And then we finally, we have um, fifth group over here. So if I give you the panoramic view, it's one, two, three, four and five and we do this periodically during the day so that you can get an idea of what we're doing um, and that's basically what it's about a, a lot of the class we present them with different scenarios as we go 